in a sense, we're lucky to have such a great orchestra on our doorstep with these wonderful players who can be professors at the Conservatoire. And of course, for the people who are looking to do an orchestral career and play with a symphony orchestra, that they couldn't possibly have better training. And I think Birmingham uh, as a city, musically, is on a, on a roll, really. I mean, the orchestra's playing as best as I've ever heard them. The prom was absolutely fantastic. Thank you, yeah. It's widely acknowledged that Symphony Hall's actually the best concert hall in the country. Absolutely. Um, and Town Hall is not bad either, is it? It's certainly the so, best 1,000 seat. Yes. So you know. we are actually slightly spoilt in Birmingham. And I, I, I don't know, maybe we don't shout about it enough, or I'm not really quite sure how we can shout about our musical scene, but it's certainly very healthy. You're drawing students yes. from all around the I world. Mean, I think we're very but... fortunate to have great support from the university. You know, to, to build a conservatoire at this moment in time yeah. is a big undertaking Absolutely. and a big investment. It's going to cost a lot of money, and uh, I, I think that they, they will be rewarded with a magnificent building. That New Street Station and the grad it, it's absolutely packed. It is. I mean, I was told um, on the opening of the John Lewis on, on the Saturday, they had 100,000 people go through there. It's word of mouth, I think, in Birmingham's case. I think there's a, an, an awful lot on offer here, and perhaps people in London don't really realise it. If we think about the, you know, the broad majority of schools... Yes, I've always believed that, that all children should have access to music. I think it's completely wrong to deny them. Actually, some of the greatest works of mankind, and exactly. they leave school, they go through school, and perhaps they never get to hear anything about them. Absolutely. And uh, that, that shouldn't really be right in the, in the 21st century. Mm -hmm.